Hello guys and welcome back to the dap world. In the previous tutorial we have deployed the program on local net and devnet. And now let's build the front end of our dap. To develop front end we are going to use react.js. If you are already familiar with react, it's good to go. But if you are not aware with react, just follow along and you will be understanding it. You can also use any one of the javascript frameworks or even simple vanilla javascript. Now create a new folder front end and create a react application with npx create react app and then the application name. This will create one project for us. So this is how the directory will look like. Now our interest is in app.css and app.js files. Here we will use plain css to style our front end but you can use bootstrap, tailwind, chakra ui etc whatever you like. Then the next step will be installing Anchor and Solana Web3. Install Anchor and Solana Web3 as node dependencies. I know you might be thinking that we have already installed these dependencies. But let me remind you that this is totally different environment than the previous one. You can check the package.json file before installing this and you will not find these dependencies. We need to import it in the react application. Now let's talk about the browser based phantom wallet. We need wallets to interact with applications on blockchain. Just like Metamask is used for Ethereum, Phantom is used for Solana. You can use built-in wallet adapter also but Phantom is good. You can visit their website and install the browser extension and set up the wallet. Now it's time to connect our app with Phantom wallet. That's it for this topic. In the next topic, we will discuss how to connect this Phantom wallet with our application. See you in the next tutorial.